Ew, I smell it. Uh, coconut or spoiled milk? I have just been using um, a BB cream because I feel like I don't need the the extra coverage kind of thing. And today I used uh, my regular foundation. All of my makeup comes from Walmart. I just don't need to or want to spend a bunch of money on makeup. So all of my all of my makeup comes from Walmart. So I can definitely tell a huge difference from my skin today, like um, coverage-wise, using foundation versus the BB cream. So I think I'm gonna start switching back to foundation. What? What? But that has nothing to do with what we're doing right now. Hate elevators. Hate elevators. Why? I just do. I don't know why. Just Are you ready for kindergarten? Yeah. We're waiting on the doctor and she does have to get three little pokes in her leg. So hopefully that goes okay. Just three little pokes in your leg, okay? Just in one leg, I think. Yeah, okay. That's a funny picture. Is that real? No. I don't know, that'd be funny. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna finish up here and then probably. Why is the phone on the picture? I don't know. Um, finish up here and then figure out what we're doing for the rest of the day because I want to figure out um, something to do for our anniversary. I want to do something little for breath, I think. <laughs> I cannot believe that Dale did not cry. I know. He just smiled. It was crazy. Dale <laughs> always smiled. For shots, when before. You like didn't I, even. I was sitting there trying to hold your hand. Yeah, I'm. I'm older than her, and I was crying. You did good, baby. You did so good. I'm so proud of you. But it did kind of hurt. Oh, I'm sure yeah. it hurt. You got three little I'm sure it hurt, babe. So oh my gosh, Daylin had to get three shots, which I kind of knew going into it, Daylin, that you were gonna have to get shots, but I feel like there's two ways to go about when your kids get shots. One way is to tell them ahead of time so they can prepare for it mentally, and the second way, which is the way that I choose to do it, because um, my kids are the kind of kids that will they'll sit there and they'll think about it, especially Dalton. They'll dwell on it. They'll they'll work themselves up where if it's spur of the moment things will go a lot smoother so I did not say that she had to get shots and I was unsure too and I didn't want to get her worked up over it but she had to get three shots I told her she was fine with it the nurses come in 
They give it to her in her arm, which I thought they would be giving it to you in your leg, which is fine. They give her the shots. They did say leg. Oh, well, they gave her the shots in the, the arm and she, um, she did great. Like she didn't cry. She, I was sitting there holding her hand and I was trying to squeeze her hand so that she would like squeeze my hand back. She just sat there and just like, she almost, yeah, she almost smiled. You did so good. So three things that I took out of this is that one, we need to start eating better. Two, less iPad time, which all of these things I've been wanting to work on. We've been slowly working on it, but this just confirms it. This is like that push that I needed to Ow. continue um, eating better, less iPad time, and um, practicing, and this is for both of you, practicing your, you know, school stuff. I'm gonna take so, I need to get school supplies. The second thing is, how did Dalton scream? Okay. And I'm older. All right, so I think we are going I'm to older. go get school supplies. I also yeah. need, I would also like to run up to grab us dinner, but maybe I won't. I'm gonna wait. Why? You know what, we're gonna go, we're gonna get a couple things for the school supplies, because Grandma Angie said that she's gonna buy the rest of the stuff. We'll get your guys' school supplies, a couple things. And then after that, we're gonna go to Walmart, and I'm gonna pick up something for Daddy to eat. Because I'm gonna make him his favorite dinner for tonight. Okay. What is it? Um, I don't know yet. even said how um how brave she was she literally sat there and she was just like i wish i would have i wish i would have recorded it because it was the funniest thing she sat there and i'm waiting for it i'm like waiting for it waiting for it waiting for it i'm holding her hand trying to squeeze her hand and she yes, just I smiles <laughs> she did so good day good job baby Proud of you. She did I'm so proud of good. Like, thank you. Can you act like you like him? I'm recording. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> we are going to play that nasty ass jelly bean game. Oh, Eric, hold your finger like back there. It's not spinning. Why is there a dog here on it? Jeez. Uh oh. Okay, hold on. Ready? You win. Uh -oh. Stinky bugger uh -oh. toasted marshmallow. Yeah. Stink bug or toasted marshmallow? Dang, look at stink bug. Toasted marshmallow. Toasted marshmallow. Ooh, that's stink bug. Ooh, that's bad. Dang, look at stink bug. No, babe, he cannot play. <laughs> babe, no more. No, 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 no. You always smell it. Ugh, coconut or soil milk. <laughs> <laughs> How did I 
did I get so lucky? It was coconut. That's coconut. Nah. Oh, dang you. I need to wipe one Not a lot of things make me want to throw up, but this game makes me want to throw up. Okay, okay we'll do one more, all right? Why? One more. Uh-oh. Step by step. This one? Oh, God. What? What is it? Barf. Or dead fish. No, it's peach or barf. I just, it's barf. No, no, no way. I'm done. I'm done. Eat it. I'm done. Now, eat it. Is that barf or peach? Peach. Eat it. Don't, I'm not eating it. I'm not. I cannot. There's not a lot of things that make me want to gag. Um, this is not, not this a lot is of not bad. That gross me out. This if is I not see bad. And you eat it, babe. No, I'm not. If I see someone else throwing up, I don't throw up. I've changed many poopy diapers. I've gotten pooped on. I've gotten peed on. This game is disgusting. TV. I made bread a dessert. I was going to give him a back rub and turn on a movie, um, get the kids in bed, and then we would watch a little TV in our room. This is what happened. He's sleeping. <laughs> oh, it never, it never works out. <laughs> Thank God I didn't have something big planned. Finally made my way outside. Normally my animals go, automatically go into their beds um, as the sun goes down when it starts to get a little bit darker, but I think they're in right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and try to get in an early habit of closing that down and getting my kids to bed because I'm trying to get them into that like school routine. I did want to talk to you guys really quick about first things first. I just wanted to say thank you to everyone who has recently subscribed. Thank you to everyone who has left comments or personally messaged me or you know started following me on Instagram. Um, Without going into a huge rant, I just want you guys to know that I genuinely appreciate all of you. I have also been thinking about doing a video with Brett and I, and I want to call it a Q&A, but it's not going to be like where we sit down in front of a camera and my favorite color is blue. Like, I don't want it to be this boring video like that. I want it to be fun and lighthearted because I know he's hardly in my videos. Like when he's home, he's tired. And if we're outside doing something when he gets home, then he's outside doing stuff. But, um, and as you can see, nights do not go as planned. So it's hard for me to plan anything because he's tired, you know? So, so anyways, I have a couple different ideas for the video that I would like to do to make it more interesting and not like a boring sit down video. Um, mainly focus on Brett and I to get to know us as a couple, to get to know us individually, to get to know us as as parents, get to know him as a dad or me as a mom. And when I brought this idea to him, he said he will do it if anyone came and brought questions. Like he just doesn't want to sit there and like, you know, be boring in front of a camera. So I know a lot of you are new. I know maybe you've only seen one of my videos. 
and you have no idea what to even ask or what we're even about or who we even are, totally get it. If you do have any questions or anything that's on your mind or anything, please let me know. Um, you can leave comments on my YouTube. You can also go to my Instagram and leave comments under any of the pictures. I think I will wait and maybe talk about it um, a couple more times before we actually create, sit down and create the video. We will have to do it on a weekend. So I have to be really strategic about like how I plan it. So yeah, I don't know if you have any questions, anything you want to know, um, let me know. Shepherd, stop eating the goat food. Jeez. All right, guys, I need to go inside. Um, hopefully, that tree house will be done pretty soon. I don't know if I showed you guys. I think if you watched the last vlog, you kind of saw it being made, but it's pretty big. There, you can kind of see how big it is. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for today. Thank you again so much for hanging out with us. Again, let me know if you have any questions or anything you want to know about us anything um, I seriously genuinely appreciate all of you guys for taking an interest in this very simple non YouTube life I guess out here I'm glad that I can show kind of this side of life because I feel like a lot of the time YouTube is filled with materialistic things and uh, you know, you gotta have a lot of money and uh, extravagant things and drama and in your life and that's what's important and that's what makes you cool and that's what makes you happy and um, hopefully I can show a different side that you can still be happy and not have that stuff, you know what I mean? So, thank you guys for your support and uh, we will see you soon, bye.